Hey everyone, it's Robert Watson coming at you with a quick video. Um, well, I don't, I don't know if it's going to be quick or not, but um, I'm absolutely ecstatic right now because uh, I just got a, a special package in from one of my YouTube subscribers named... Uh, I'm not even going to try it. <laughs> uh, there it is. There's the YouTube name. Um, I just want you guys to go give him a sub because... Like, go subscribe to him. He's a really great guy. He collects Harry Potter stuff as well. Um, he does a lot of sports stuff as well, but uh, he he's also a Harry Potter collector. Um, he sent the he sent me a box. Like he he contacted me a couple weeks ago, um, saying that he, like he was uh, interested in sending me something, and you know he said he's gonna send me a couple cards. And I I thought you know maybe like one, two, or three cards or something. And today I come home from uh, running one of the Harry Potter events that I do here in town and. There's this box, and I'm just like, uh, why is there a box for me? Like, I didn't under I didn't understand why, and so I, uh, upon further inspection, I saw on the bottom it said Merry Christmas from uh, one Harry Potter um, collector to another, and I opened it up, and he sent me these like custom packs of uh, Harry Potter cards. Um, I haven't opened them; I just took them out of the box just for time's sake, and. Uh, so I guess we should just <laughs> pop them open and see what we get. So right off the bat, I'll actually I'll focus it here first. Uh, focus. So right off the bat, we get a Draco Malfoy from base set. Um, he's number three of 116, which is really cool. Um, I do already have him, but in, I have him in poor condition. So this is, looks to be a mint condition. Uh, he said it's straight from a box, basically, so uh, that's really, really nice of you, man. I really appreciate it. Um, Elixir of Life. Um, <laughs> I, I, funny enough, just got this card um, from a trade online, but uh, I didn't get it hollow, so that's really cool. I, I really I really appreciate this, man. I, <laughs> I don't even think I can... I can't describe how I feel right now, because I'm just so happy. Um, thank you so much. Uh, so we have a hollow Gringotts cart ride from base set. A hollow Hannah Abbott. Once again from base set. Human chess game from base set. Holographic. Invisibility cloak from base set. Uh, is it from base set? Yes. From base set. And then Nearly Headless Nick, which is, honestly, I love this card. I just love the artwork in it, uh, you know, him pulling his head off right there. Um, so that's really cool. Like, oh, wow, I'm, I'm so, like, this is amazing. I'm sorry. I, 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 uh, <laughs> I come home and get this, like, to come home to find this. This is just pretty much the best Christmas gift anyone anyone can give me. Harry Potter stuff. Um, so we have a crazed capybara um, hollow. This is from Chamber of Secrets set. That's really cool. Don't have that yet. Actually, I don't think I've, I don't think I have many of these cards. Um, Dobby's Help holographic from Chamber of Secrets, I guess. I guess. Um, Entrancing Enchantment hollow. That's cool. Haha, <laughs> uh, adorable. It's Errol, the really dense owl. Now we have Flying Laps, nice holographic card. Impersonating Goyle, a, holog a holographic card again. Memory Charm, I like the little telephone box there, that's really cool. Potions Test, holographic. Serpent Sortia, that is wicked. What an awesome looking card. And another thing, he shipped them really well. Like, if, if you guys are ever going to do a trade with him, I'd really recommend it. Because he he ships them very, like, in a very safe manner. And, like, the cards aren't going to get damaged. And they're in these Ultra Pro sleeves. And he, he's he's a good person to trade with. If you, if you are uh, looking to trade with him or if you're thinking about trading with him, definitely do it. Because he's a, he's a great guy. Um, Slytherin Common Room, that's really cool. Oh, wicked, the Whomping Willow. <laughs> that's so cool. Damage each turn, eight. Wow, that is a dangerous card. Um, I've only, I, 
I don't technically play the card game um, I, as like as much as I collect, but I've been reading the rules and everything, and I'm learning to play, and I kind of want to create a deck, so actually some of these cards that are duplicates for me, I'm probably going to put towards building a deck, and uh, that would be really cool. I don't have duplicates of that Whomping Willow, of course, but just the one is crazy. I can't believe how powerful it is. Third pack. Oh, right off the bat, there's a card I need right there, Hermione Granger. Um, in this set, there are two Hermione cards. There's like a regular one and another, and like a different one. Um, I didn't have this one. Wow, her eyes are actually really creepy there. If, uh, if I hold at the right angle, only her eyes glow. And let's see if I can get it to do that again. Did it for me. Come on, do it again. I don't know, her eyes were glowing at one point with just green and looked terrifying. <laughs> Um, so yeah, there's Hermione Granger, the one I need for my collection. It's hard to see because of the, the, they're the premium holofoil prints. Oh, there's the Half-Blood Prince himself, uh, Professor Severus Snape. I got him in a, uh, sort of a homemade booster pack from the, like a market a couple weeks ago, or a few weeks ago. In really, like, poor condition, but it was still fine with me, but he sent me a nice mint condition one, which is really great. Thank you, uh... <coughs> That guy. <laughs> Sorry. I'm not even going to try to say it. We got Ron Weasley here. If we can see him. Maybe. There he is. Oliver Wood. Oh, wicked. That's so cool. Actually, it's really cool because if you look at it from like the angle I'm looking at it, uh, it kind of looks like the brooms flying out of the um, card. So there's Oliver Wood. Halloween Feast Holographic. Wow. Hagrid's House. Nice. That's one of the ones I needed uh, for my uh, Adventures at Hogwarts set. And I think there's the other one I needed for my Adventure at Hogwarts set. I think I just completed it. Um, Wellscreen uh, Dragon. That, oh, man, this is insane. And the fact that they're all holographic. You didn't need to do this, man. <laughs> That's crazy, like, this is why I love my subscribers, because you guys are awesome. Um, I'm so happy to have you guys, I really appreciate it, honestly, like, I can't believe that there's actually, I think right now I've got like 320 subscribers, I can't believe there's actually 320 people willing to watch me talk about Harry Potter cards, um, or even just Harry Potter stuff in general. I really do appreciate it, guys. So we've got No Time to Play. Scabbers, oh adorable, so cute. Dragon hide gloves, sparkly. <laughs> Self stirring cauldron, hollow. Three month long match. Through the arch. Dumbledore's watch. That's a really cool one. End of the year feast or end of year feast. Fang. A galleon. Ooh, that's pretty. I like that card. Great hall. Meeting Fluffy. Oh, that's cool. And lastly, oh, actually, no, there's one more card after this. Um, we have Riding the Centaur. And lastly, uh, Start of Term Feast, which is a really neat looking card. So, once again, thank you to you. I don't want to, I'm not sure if you want your name set on YouTube. Um, so, I'll just show this. Once again, everyone, go subscribe to him. He's an amazing, amazing YouTuber. He's what keeps. YouTube going and you know people are just random acts of kindness you know he, he didn't have to do this but he was kind enough to do it and I just really appreciate it so thank you um, thanks for watching guys don't forget to subscribe thumbs up this video or like it or rate it or whatever YouTube's doing right now they seem to change their mind every week um, and yeah bye